the new Duke and Duchess of Sussex will be heading to Australia, New Zealand, Fiji and the United Kingdom of Tonga for their first tour as a married couple, two of the same locations that Harry's father and late mother visited on their first trip together. Harry and Meghan are paying tribute to Princess Diana, signifying with the 36-year-old former U.S. actress wearing her aquamarine ring for her wedding reception. Here are some of stops the Duke and Duchess of Sussex could make in Australia and New Zealand. Heirs Rock Prince Charles and Princess Diana, as well as Harry's brother William and his wife Kate Middleton, took some pictures in front of the iconic Heirs Rock. This site is sacred to the indigenous people of Australia and started forming around 550 million years ago. Sydney Opera House This is one of the most iconic attractions in the world, and thousands of royal fans gathered outside the unmissable building when the two royals passed through in their car. There will likely be similar fanfare when Harry and Meghan visit, with fans hoping they decide to take in a performance at the Opera House. Royal Walkabout Princess Diana was renowned for connecting so closely with children on royal walkabouts. Meghan has so far shown she has similar qualities, so royal watchers will be looking forward to getting up close to the couple when they head down under. Leaving on a jet plane Diana and Charles shared some memorable moments while boarding their planes during their trips to Australia and New Zealand. This would be the first time we will see Harry and Meghan on a plane, waving to their many fans. Carriage Ride The Prince and Princess of Wales took full advantage of enjoying all the experiences on their first tour together, which included riding a stagecoach through Sovereign Hill and Ballarat, Australia. Royal watchers will be hoping that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, who have already taken memorable carriage rides following their wedding and at the Trooping of the Colour ceremony, will make a similar trip. Embracing Young Fans Princess Diana was renowned for her love of children, and it seems Meghan has learned from the best as she has embraced many on the royal visits she has been on. Hitting the Dance Floor Many will also be hoping to see Harry and Meghan hitting the dance floor during a state dinner while on their tour. Charles and Diana showed off some of their best moves while at a charity ball in Australia. War Memorial Visit Away from the Razmataz, the Prince and Princess of Wales visited a war memorial in Canberra. It's no secret that the health of war veterans is very close to Prince Harry's heart, who visited the landmark in 2015 so it wouldn't be a surprise to see the royal couple visit. Australian Polo Prince Harry might follow in his father's footsteps and try his hand at Australian Polo. Prince Charles kissed his late wife after a match in Melbourne during their first tour together. Could history repeat itself, repeat itself?